What's going on everybody? So, today we're actually taking a trip. Taking you guys on a nice little trip with me to Atlanta, Georgia or the North Cross, Georgia area. Yeah, it's about to be fun. It's about to be crazy. Just finished packing up. Actually, just put stuff in my camera bag so it's going to be kind of intense. Yeah, let me, uh, let me show you my camera bag real quick. Yeah, I uh, tend to take a lot of stuff, a lot of different lenses in there. Also take my computer because most likely we'll be editing on the plane. But that's how it is, man. That is how it is. But yeah, look, this is a, a percussion life setup. Oh yeah, look at that. A little, a little behind the scenes, something y'all don't get to see. Look at that. You see, I took a lot of my stuff. I'm leaving another camera behind. It's my older camera, but yeah it's gonna be fun i got some videos for the upcoming week and uh yeah i'm gonna miss my babies but we're gonna see who makes these oh yeah so yeah let me take you on this nice little trip oh yeah it's about to be fun cue the b-roll <laughs> So yeah, we're here in the Norcross area of Georgia. I'm actually here for a family thing. My cousin just got married. Congrats, Cynthia and Daniel. On your union, you gotta love it. But because I knew I was coming down to Georgia, I actually reached out to Ryan from Manito Percussion and said, hey, I'm gonna be in the area. Can I visit? And of course, Ryan was down, man. So I'm about to meet up a couple of people and we're about to head over there and it's about to be some adventurous times but yeah i'm about to uh crush my little english muffin and then uh head over there man it's gonna be hours and hours of fun but uh yeah let me take you on this adventure Whoosh.
What's going on everybody? So I am with Ryan from My Nathan Percussion and I'm telling you, I'm like so excited. Like yeah, he knows it too because I've been, I, I think I cried earlier playing his drums. <laughs> um, and honestly, it's just an honor and a privilege, seriously Ryan, to, to be here to show me around your shop. Um, there's some secret things that you guys can't see, but uh, it's right okay. Behind you. Yeah, it's right behind you. Literally, it's right <laughs> behind you. But um, honestly, thank you, Ryan, for for just having me, hosting me, and uh, telling me your story, man. Honestly, I'm I'm inspired um, as a as just as a player because seeing how you do your art, and I'm telling you, it, it's just it's a lot of work. So if you if you have a Manita percussion product or anything like. Trust me, a lot of soul, a lot of heart went into it. Um, a lot of magic, a lot of work, a lot of patience, man. So uh, I, I found like a even a bigger respect for for wow. you, just as a as an artist and maker, and and just everything that you do, man. So so seriously, thank you for for having me here, man. Man, that's completely <laughs> humbling. It is such a pleasure and an honor to have you here. Yeah. I, I, we've been so excited about having you, man. And then it's just been an absolutely wonderful day, and getting to hear you sit on the congas and play <laughs> and be able to stand back and listen and just be right there in the moment man it, it has been uh, an absolute honor and a massive pleasure you know, uh, really man. having you here I, I can't wait for the next time oh man yeah i have to so my family's down here like i said earlier in the video i'm here strictly for family they think i'm here for family stuff but i'm really here just because i wanted to meet him um, new, a family. Lot of people, new family seriously um seeing <laughs> Seeing Chris, seeing Frankly, seeing Frankie, sorry, seeing Swen, and um, Kane. Kane, yeah, yeah, seeing, man, literally, and they all could play, man. I was like scared to to get, to get oh, on the set. Good. He's a really bad drummer. I think I already talked about. I think I already post. I'm gonna by that time I'll post a video of his makuta. Trust me, dude's a really bad player, man. Well versed on the drums and uh, just speaks volume on the fact that he knows what he's talking about when making these drums. So, um, you know, you guys already know how I feel about mass-produced drums, and they're, they're a tool, they're, you know, they have their part, but there's a, an appreciation when it comes to um, companies like Manito Percussion, and, and he knows, man, we, we have a good relationship, but, uh, you know, I, 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 I get my skins, <laughs> like, <laughs> I pay for my skins, you know, so it's, um, it's, it's something not that, you know, he's not paying me to do this, he didn't, he didn't even really, like, you know, I had to ask for permission to record, but it's like, uh, you know, he's not telling me to put this up. You know, it's 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 out of my heart, it's out of my gratitude that you know we're here and and seeing all this beautiful, beautiful mess because that's beautiful mess right there. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, here this is. Uh, <laughs> I cleaned the shop as well as I could, but I had to leave a little bit for Pete Musser because <laughs> he gives me a hard time every yeah. time it's too clean. <laughs> Shout so, out PM Percussion, man. Shout out PM. <laughs> Um, but yeah, man. Thank you, Ryan. Seriously, Dude. I, I am, I am, I am blessed to have a relationship with you, man, and and see this, and uh, I, I don't know. I am just surprised. Chris, who's holding the camera, owns four or six. Sorry, Manita Percussion drums, and even he saw like how much work um, gets put into just his drums, and it's unbelievable. Um, just the process, just how everything gets made, and. I think the attention to detail, because just the fact how you were explaining to me how just the inside of the drum, how much of a great impact it does with the tone, from the skins that you get, from the hardware that he uses, it's just, um, I don't know, I'm, I'm left in awe, I'm left inspired, I, I, I told him like in about a year, I'm going to probably get some, some of his <laughs> drums, man, I'm going to try, I don't know what I'm going to do, and I'm looking forward to what um, this company's doing, and hopefully they get to build relationships, man, and with uh, a lot of bigger companies because people like Ryan deserve it. So I'm just putting that out there. <laughs> but again, um, it's awesome. Thank you again, Ryan, for having me here, man. I am privileged and I had fun. And I hope whatever you recorded, I did okay because oh, I was man. I was struggling, y'all. <laughs> please, please. <laughs> y'all know he's he's making no, <laughs> nah. You know, you've seen, you've no. heard. No nah, man, I, I like I would play and I would have to stop playing because I'll just be like, what is this sound coming from, man? <laughs> so um, yeah, man, I'm I'm seriously privileged to to be one of the few people that get to come here and and um, meet you, beautiful family, beautiful time, beautiful dogs. So it was a 
it was a beautiful moment man so i hope you guys enjoyed this video um y'all already know what to do like subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one you gotta love it <laughs> <laughs> so it's like 1 10 in the morning and i finally finished editing video for monday well today's monday i think by the time you're seeing this video it's probably like wednesday but yeah man sometimes the grind don't stop you're you're somewhere and you gotta you gotta keep this thing going man it's crazy it's crazy unbelievable my goodness i'm exhausted it's been a long day but man it's been a beautiful day i'm excited and i think you're gonna like this video the makuta video again thank you ryan for sharing this pattern with the world it's beautiful my goodness gotta love it i also i don't think i've ever shown you guys the kind of timeline of uh, how my video edits go and look like it's kind of intense this is all the work that gets put into it all the different angles all the cameras all the cuts the audios kind of gets kind of intense man but yeah it's a lot of work a lot of work a lot of work